In this video, we will learn how to fix api-ms-win-core-localization l1.dll is missing. So let's begin. So the process is really easy and simple. Simply go and open up your Google Chrome browser. Here we go. And here type in the error that you are getting like in my case this DLL error and go to simply download. Here we are. Now scroll down below. There are multiple websites. I would prefer this ststutorials.com. Simply go and open it. Now here we are. Simply scroll down below until you see the download section. So here we are. Now before moving on, you need to find out what kind of system you have. Either it is 32-bit system or 64-bit system. For that, simply go to your Windows and here type in for this PC. Here we are. Right click it and go to properties. Against the system type, you can see what kind of system you have. In my case, I have 64-bit operating system. So I would be solving the problem for 32-bit as well as 64-bit. So you don't need to worry if you are on 32-bit. So first we will solve the problem for 32-bit operating systems. For that you need to simply download 32-bit file. Download it. And this download would take around 10 to 12 seconds. So simply go and wait for it. So once the download is complete, simply go and open up your downloads here we are simply go and open it up here we have another folder simply go and here we have the tll file so copy this tll file go to your this pc go to local disk c go to windows where your windows is installed and scroll down below and go to sys wow 64 here we are open it and paste the 32-bit DLL file here. So, go back. We are done with solving the problem for 32-bit operating system. So those people can simply restart their PC and their problem will be solved. Now we will solve the problem for 64-bit operating systems. For them simply go here. For 64-bit operating system, we need the 32-bit file as well as a 64-bit file. I have already downloaded the 32-bit file. I will now download the 64-bit file. And again, it will take a bit of a time, so wait for it. Here we go. Now simply go to your downloads. I would be opening in the new window. Here we are. We have 32-bit as 64-bit. Go to 32-bit folder, copy the 32-bit DLL file, copy it, go to Windows and go to SysWow64 and paste the 32-bit file here. Now go back and again go to the download section and go to 64-bit file, copy, open it. Copy the 64-bit DLL, go to your Windows folder, go to System32 and paste the 64-bit DLL file here. And now you can simply go and restart your 64-bit PC and your problem will be solved. If you have confusions regarding the instructions, you can read these instructions from here as well. So hope it has helped you in solving this DLL missing error on Windows 10, 7 or 8. But before you go, please like, subscribe and share. Thank you.